hello, we are with uh, Kim Kopta, uh, one of the uh, elite runners for the UTMB. How are you? What yeah. do you feel about the, the, this year at UTMB? Well, I'm super excited. Uh, it's my first 100 miler, so, uh, uh, but uh, so I thought, I'm a bit nervous as well <laughs> because it's long. <laughs> okay, how do you see your competitors? Uh, so, you know, in this kind of race, you don't see the other girls as competitors, huh? I'm great friends with several of them, and some of them are like yeah, people I really look up to as athletes. I'm, I'm really sad that Nuria was, isn't able to race because she's one of the persons that I really look up to as, as, as an ultra runner because she really pushed the limits of what's possible, I think. But Caroline is here, so I think it will. She's also a person that's done amazing stuff. So, and yeah, it's just. Uh, you have to uh, do your own. I mean, you don't compete against anyone else when it's this long. Now. In the end, you compete against yourself because it's not. This is probably <laughs> so tough. So it's your own inner um, limitations that's your and uh, that's the competitor. Yeah. Well, tell, tell us uh, how you have trained for 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 this year. Yeah, so I've tried to build up as well as I can because I just, I, I guess I couldn't run a hundred miler just to try, uh, uh, know how it feels. But I really wanted to do UTMB because it's a like a mythical special thing to uh, run uh, around the whole massif. Um, but I think I prepared well. I run a lot in the mountains and I've done some ultras to try and prepare for night running and stuff and see how the body reacts. So just go. Now it's rest and go. Okay, good luck for the race. Thank, Thank you very you. much. Say hello. <laughs> Bye.